we have a, another plan here. What are we building, William? Um, I don't know. A rabbit cage? Yeah, a rabbit cage. So I have an eight by two by two rabbit hutch, and we're gonna build a little frame here, and we're gonna roof the top, and then we're gonna roof the back, and then I want to sort of mold this to make a pooper scooper where the poop will fall down into a five gallon bucket. Here's the top right here. And I put this board to make it, you know, have a little bit of curve to it. I made a mistake. I went out cheap and bought two by threes instead of two by fours. And uh, it's it's not good, they're, they're splitting. But I'm hoping that the cement will uh, make the difference. So we're gonna staple. Daddy. What will? Yeah, this would be a good playhouse size, wouldn't it? Yep. Um, I went down to the Goodwill and bought some sheets at, you know, a dollar a piece, whatever. We're going to use sheets this time to see how it works. Hey, William. Hello. So we stapled down the bottom and we stapled, pulled it tight and stapled this ridge piece. And then we have just tacked this one up because it's going to overlap, okay? This kind of going to give you a drip edge, all right? And then this will be the back and about two and a half, three feet down that way. We're going to put another cross board and it's going to fold under. All right, we're going to be trapped. Yep. You think this would make a cool playhouse? Oh, yeah. So now I've got to mix my cement. And I'm going to mix this a lot looser than I did for the... Uh, um, outhouse door because I'm going to brush it on. So this is like I cut off a large Aquafina bottle and then I've got a large uh, container, a cottage cheese container. Right? Yeah. There's, it's two scoops of the mortar mix, one Aquafina bottle of water, one aquafina bottle of paint at least for the first coat because it brushes on and i'm finding it's it's a lot more efficient than when i did it before on the outhouse and it was too thick my plan is for this to seep in harden and then i'll come back with uh, you know maybe some thicker stuff Whereas on the, the uh, outhouse, we went too thick, and now we got to come back with thin to fill up the holes. Remember, I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I'm just experimenting, right? Yep. But this is, just a, this is just a rabbit hutch, and as long as it gives us some form, if it's not waterproof, I can always put tarps over it, right? Hey, Daddy. Hey, Will. It's, it's like a big form of a playhouse. But this is about fifty dollars worth of materials. The paint was ten bucks. The wood was uh, the rest. Got forty-three sheets were about a dollar a piece. I got three of them, but I've only used two because one of them's too small. So that's not that expensive for something this big, especially if it works. You can help me paint, you better yep. not let your mama catch you. If you get paint on your clothes, I'm going to whoop us both. Yep, two glasses. Because we are bad boys. Bad boys, bad boys, bad what you going to do? Yeah, I'm painting, ha ha, I'm beating daddy, I'm painting the green. Daddy's losing. You're painting green? Yep, and daddy's losing. Yeah, I'm the best painter. All right, here it is, painted. I went over it once, went over part of it twice. Um, it's starting to smooth up a little bit. You can't see light through it through the other side except for just in a couple of places. I'm gonna let this sit and dry for about a week 
not because it probably needs to sit and dry for a week, but because I'm out of money for the wood and I need a one more sheet. Uh, the third one I bought wasn't big enough to make my pooper scooper. Um, and I need to sort of think how I want to do that. I need some more wood to, to strengthen up the frame a little bit. Two by threes just weren't good enough, but I'm hoping that once this dries, it'll give it some support, but I also know it'll be top heavy. So stay tuned, maybe another week, two weeks or so. Uh, we'll get this thing working. Thanks.